No. Well, right as the Ogre Talent start. <laughs> I don't think it would be a... I don't know. I'm not sure about Diablo 3 expansion, I reckon. Hang on, hang on. I'm looking at the forums. Okay, okay. This looks better. Okay. Well, <laughs> this looks better for us. Um, <laughs> Linking. It would fit Diablo, but it would also fit in with an Undersea expansion. I'm trying to think how it would fit in with Burning Legion, because that seems to be the path that everybody's whoring on, and Blizzard even said... Yeah, but Mr. Pandaria doesn't fit in with... You know, it doesn't fit in with the word Shah, it doesn't fit in with Shah or anything, does it? That's just added story, you know? It doesn't all have to jump in the name. Yeah, touche, I guess. Um... I don't know. The dot below is a place, the dot below is a place inhabited by Demon Sad. But yeah, so from the information on it, I'm saying it's definitely WoW expansion. I don't think it's Diablo. I just... Here we go. Uh, the Dark Below, aside from being an all-round awesome title, strongly hints at either an ocean-themed expansion, uh, Ozomat before the Ozomat bore the title "Friend of uh, Fiend of the Dark Below," oh. ah, or an underground expansion. Mm, maybe. Yeah. My two main wishes yeah, for the next WoW expansion are so either an ocean-themed expansion with a, with a Shara as the main villain, or an underground expansion based on the old gods. Yes, that's what I'd like. So this has this has me very excited. As you know, Rob. Uh, no, I lost the card. I can't say these words. Najatar, all places I'd love to go. Bleh. Closed mouth, can't say these words. Now it should be noted that there is mention of the Dark Below being associated with demons in Warcraft lore. Directly. So it could be a hint of a Burning Legion expansion, which is what everyone expected to follow Pandaria. But this mention of the Dark Below comes from non-canon RPG. It comes from the non-canon RPG. So I wouldn't put too much stock in the idea. Mm. Of course, there's one more possibility. Diablo! Um, there's been mentions in Old God Lore to the Dark Forest and Nazjatar, but it doesn't mention where they are in Azeroth, but like, um, there's not much information on them, but they are mentioned a lot in Old God Lore, like, mm. as origins and stuff like that, so maybe, I don't know, it could be reference to that. One second, let me read, let me read the Diablo theory then on here. Mm -hmm. It could also be the title for a Diablo 3 expansion. Yeah, uh, <laughs> and there is a lot of talk that maybe announcing the Diablo 3 expansion soon, possibly at Gamescom, roughly a week from now. Oh, wow. Yeah. Um, I hope we it's not, though. We keep up to date on this. We do. I hope it's not, though, partly because I really like the idea of Ashara and all the old gods getting an expansion, and partly because I was hoping the Diablo 3 expansion would involve the angels as the main villains. The Dark Below, if it is a Diablo 3, if it is a Diablo expansion, sounds like yet another traipse to hell, which is all well and good, but I'd like to see Diablo explore new frontiers a bit more. Agreed. I tell you what, in a Diablo expansion, the thing I would love to do the most is kill Imperius, because he is a darn right dick. Mm. Yeah. And then take the Nephilim or Tyrael as the leader of heaven. <laughs> so, commence awesome. week of rampant speculation. What do you think? Naga, all gods, Diablo, Ashara riding Diablo, and Azoth riding a T-Rex, <laughs> riding a freaking shark with a freaking laser on its head. <laughs> awesome powers. Um, I want sharks with... Freaking laser beams on there. To head. be fair, we've had quite a lot of bosses recently riding T Rexes. Could happen. In fact, there's one in the next patch riding a T Rex. Yeah, there. Yeah. All right, yeah. That's it. That's all I can really find on it. Fair enough. New Blizzard trademark. And hold on, I'm just gonna read all the legal jingle on it. So, um, identification. So it's a computer game software downloadable from Global Computer Network, so it's an expansion pack, not a whole new game. It's not a book or anything like that. Mm-hmm. Oh, good. So it's definitely an expansion for either StarCraft Unlikely, one just came out. That is everything to do with Hearthstone. So it's Diablo or WoW. Diablo or WoW later. New Blizzard trademark. Oh, Wait, pretty yeah. cool. Um, um, Sorry, drink a milk chocolate. I hate it when they do this, because Mist of Pandaria was obvious, because Pandaria was an... Well, not Pandaria, but the Pandarin were an existing law Faction feature. in law, yeah. Yeah, but this is just uncallable. <laughs> like, really? Well, the fact that they're down below is directly referenced in law by those words. Yeah. The down below is a place demons, it's a place, it's a place demons uh, like, you know, not siding with the Burning Legion draw their power from. Yeah. I th I, it's got to be worried. I don't think this is Diablo. As much as I'd like, as much as I would like news on the Diablo expansion, we'll keep up to date in a week. Yeah, we can look up at Gamescom. Hopefully, get some content mm. out on that. I'm just trying to think of um, other references. Um, 
What? Hmm, I'm thinking old gods in the shore are more than burning legion with that name. Well, I don't know. The direct reference to the dark below, you know, to the, to the dark below in burning in law, directly references to burning legion. Yeah. In the paragraph. In the same paragraph. Touche. Um. I'm saying I'm calling both right now. It could be because they did say that um, it would link in with Ashara and. Well, what did what did the exact article say that I was telling you about? It said. Um, oh, if you told me, I forget. It said either Old Gods and Burning Legion or Ashara and Burning Legion, but they're getting Ashara and Old Gods come hand in hand. So that's well, let's face it. If we if we get, if we're getting a hundred levels, if the if the it's gonna weapons, be a long expansion. If the weapons, if the weapons that drop from Garrosh, yeah, are early to level hundred, we're probably getting a ten level expansion. Meaning they can easily have two storylines as all the five five level expansions fit one. Yeah, you know I, we, yeah, that that's perfectly logical actually. It is. Um, I think this fits. There again, the Diablo expansion two acts, and yet again, hold on, right? There's a whole discussion thread on this on MMO Champions. So, sounds like a D three expansion. Um, yeah, it's either D three or Ashara. Um, okay. Yeah, a lot of speculation. I mean, it's not really... Um, let take a quick look at this. The only known mention of the Dark Below in official Warcraft canon source is in the boss Ozomat, Fiend of the Dark Below. Right. Who is the boss in... Do you know Throne of the Tides? Mm -hmm. Do you know when you rescue... Yeah, Nexuron? yeah, I know who he is. Yeah, I know Ozomat yeah, is. Yeah, you get the massive buff. Mm. Which is Fight tied Ozomat. in with Old Gods and Ashara because you are fighting Kurnaga forces mm. there. So... That would really suggest an underwater expansion with maybe a bit of... I'm calling speed. both right now. Yeah, well, I mean, they've already admitted that there'll be a bit of both. So this links in and this pretty much... So that makes me think that this could be the name of it. Mm -hmm. Because as well as... Um, it, because they said they might do an Elemental Plains expansion at some point. They've kind of ruined that by releasing Deep Hole and Firelands as a raid in a quest zone in Cataclysm. But mm. they never did bring out the Abyssal Maw, which... The um, Water Elemental Plane, so that could still be used. But, yeah, that's pretty much all we have on that so far. Yep. Okay, cool. That's all the information, I think. Okay. Let's Bye, guys. Up. Thanks for watching. <laughs>